My clan throws the best feasts, I think you'll find. You enjoy yourself? I did. But were you celebrating a morning? You looked unsure. The night of the attack, I heard sounds of bloodshed coming from the Longhouse. In moments, the city was overrun with Saxons, so I called a retreat. We all have our one day, but not like that. Not that day. I've heard this before. That the Saxons appeared as if from the shadows. In all my time in Grantbridge, this tunnel was my most careful project. The best kept secret in the city. Now a hundred or more Saxons know the smell of it. The only people who knew about this tunnel were me, and the three in my inner circle. You believe you were betrayed? I know I was. By whom? That is where I hesitate. Between Leif, Galen, and Birna, I cannot say. But they are the three who helped me dig this in secret. I hoped you might lend me your wits. You are a fresh ally. I could use your eyes and ears. I promised you I'd help secure your city. That task isn't yet done, it seems. Good. I sent Galen, Leif, and Birna to destroy what remains of Wigman's power throughout the Shire. Meet with them. Raid with them. Get to know them as best as you can. Find out which of them betrayed me. A betrayal so wicked, I cannot imagine. Yet someone willing to break an oath like that must bear some sign or defect. I need clear, sound judgment. I need you, Eivor. You have me. Thank you. Feel free to take a look around as you wish. Search the city, the tunnel, and here, a gift, for retaking Grandbridge with us. One of the few things I have left from my blood family. leads to the longhouse. The traitor marked it with a yellow cross, then opened the way and let them in. The traitor must have exited here with a few more, heading away towards the riverbank. A trail of yellow paint drops. Why did... Tough lands, old man? Those rats. I tried everything. I poured lye, I harvested locusts, I hired children to kill them. I need an army of miracles. They are pesky, 
and have ravaged your good crop. No. The gods can't get at rats. Ha! You heathens and your gods! All I want is to rid my field of rats. Feed the fair folk of the Shire. You need natural warriors to keep them at bay. My poor fields. God, why did you send so much vermin? Someone hauled this bucket of yellow paint all the way down to the riverbank. They quickly painted a longship beach here. Then they sailed off, with allies to help crew the vessel. Hurting her now, breaking your oath. That is what will bring us ill luck. Big fat No money. Eivor, I am honored you have joined us. What's your plan here? All the Shire support Soma's ruling the city. These hamlets do not. They're feeding and outfitting Wickman's army. So we will burn their homes, quick and devastating. Like the thunderclaps of Thor. How did you come to be in Soma's clan? A vision from Evolva set me on this path. It pricked my mind like a splinter, then faded. But I wanted more. For months, years, I ate only henbane, mushrooms, sacred plants, hoping to see something new. My body dwindled. I lived addled, maddened, a wanderer, taken in by Saxons and spat out. Again, and again, until Soma found me, naked and alone in the fence. She clothed and cared for me, humbled as I was. I owe her my life. Visions can be strange and powerful. What did you see? I was climbing a mountain, a lion and a snake upon my back, weighing me down. I struggled, and Soma appeared, and she eased my burden. When we reached the peak, there was hardly enough room to stand. On a point like the tip of a blade, we teetered there, gripping one another, tightly. I know I can seem distant, obsessed, but the gods are with us always. I see it as my duty to shelter Soma from their ire. What do you think of the others, Leif and Birna? Leif? He's a talented sailor, if a little enthusiastic. And Birna? Well, Birna thinks of life as a grand joke. She was a smuggler when Soma pulled her from the muck, making a living on lies. Birna is part of my clan, and I will fight beside her, irreverent as she is. But she has no care for her destiny. How did you come to join Soma's army? We came to England together, sailing under Guthrum, the great summer army the Saxons called us. When Guthrum left for Wessex, Soma stepped forward to lead. Something I would have liked to do myself. And what would you do if you were the Jarl of Grandbridge? I would run the city in my own way. I would not give Birna and Galen's opinions equal weight. Do you not trust them? I wouldn't say that. It's more. Birna's boots are stuck in the mud, and Galen's are in the sky. If death were bearing down upon us, I worry neither would have what it takes to carry us through. You were there when Guthrum made Soma the steward of Grandbridge. How did that feel? Good fortune for her. When Soma took hold, the silver started flowing and the people started dancing. She knows trade. I do wish I'd been bold enough to put myself forward, to take on the burden and honor of running a city. But that's beside the point. Soma is my Jarl's corner, and I'm her sworn man. No act of any god will change that. As a master shipbuilder, what does your work require? Patience and love. 
I know each of our vessels as a parent knows their child. But building ships needs silver too. The hard wood, the tough fabrics, the expensive paints, the yellow I use, for instance, that must be imported. A high price for a happy color. I'm certain that's why someone stole my paint some weeks ago. Blasted thief. Good conversation, Leith. Now let's take down Wickman's man. Too right, too right. Wickman's whelp awaits his reward. My warriors will... Are my muscle-banded friend? There's a nest of Wigman's men just here. We're going to pick it clean. Every last one. The fewer lies in the bush, the less itch you the pussycat. That's how I see it. How did you come to join Zoma's army? I'd been in England for ages before Guthrum, Ivar, Uppa... ...smuggling under the eyes of Saxons and Danes alike. I lied, stole, had my nose broken. Life wasn't easy, but it taught me how to bear the pain. I just laughed it away. When Soma took me in, she saw more than a smuggler in me. I was useful to something greater than myself. Useful to her vision. In a world where few saw you as worthy of trust, she's one who did. Right. And I love that about her. I love... everything about her. You seem to bring life and spirit to this clan. Does Soma feel the same? If I knew what was going on in another person's head, I'd find life dreadful and dull. But Soma seems to enjoy my company. In what way? Her own way. Just not in the way I'd like. Painful truths are easy to bear when you can laugh, you see. Delight in the face of suffering is an act of rebellion. What do you think of Soma's other warriors? Galen and Leif? Oh, Leaf's got that raw animal pull. Every time I see him, I want him to climb me like a tree and nest in my armpits. He brays about being honorable, but I've never met a man of honor who starts a fire just to be praised for putting it out. And Galen, he broods like it's an art form. He's got this self-importance that is just so charming. All of you! May God have mercy on- <laughs> That home-thieving snake might have cast a curse on us. I couldn't risk it. Christians don't curse. Wickman's on the Isle of Ely. I'll tell Soma what we've learned. That's all the evidence I think we need. You've been thorough. Who is the traitor? Garlin betrayed you. Are you certain? This will be the hardest thing I have ever done. Stay close by me, Eivor. I will need you. How do you plan to deal with this? As a leader must. My family, my inner circle. Today we make sure what has happened to us will never happen again. We end Wigman's life. But not all together, for you cannot survive the winter with a rat in your larder. Galen, you have betrayed me, Galen. I haven't! Soma, you're the key to my life. You must lead me to my destiny, carry me to the summit of victory! Do not warp what is real with the stories you tell yourself. I have seen no signs of your destiny. What I have seen is my people <sighs> slaughtered, my city befouled, and your delusions fueling the destruction. How dare you think your destiny, your greatness, outweighed all of ours! <gasps> he believed too much in fate, and not enough in us. Take him away. <laughs> 